What's going on guys, it's Rated here and welcome back to the channel. Today I definitely have the best way to rank up within Call of Duty World War 2. I've played the game for about a best bet of a day now and I definitely know the fastest ways to rank up. I'm already prestige 1 level 40 and I definitely am here to tell you guys the tips and tricks you need to know to level up fast within Call of Duty World War 2. Now hopefully you guys do enjoy the video, of course it would be greatly appreciated if you guys can leave a like down below and of course if you haven't subscribed to the channel already make sure you guys go ahead and do so because we'll be posting a ton more World War 2 videos here on the channel. With that said, let's begin. So tip number one, what I have for you guys, is prestige your divisions as soon as you can. Now, prestige your divisions will give you a ton of challenges, and also, along with a ton of challenges, it will give you a ton of XP. Not only that, but playing team deathmatch is the best way to rank up at the moment. Domination has been killed because you only get 50 points per kill, and you can't even call in kill streaks consistently. Now, I definitely recommend playing team deathmatch. You're most likely going to get your kill streaks much easier, even though you guys are seeing gameplay in the background of me playing domination i was just simply testing the best game modes now like i did say team deathmatch is the best because the games last about five minutes if you are with a good team it can roughly pull off around 35 to 40 kills if you are a good player not only that but you will get your kill streaks much easier as you're getting 100 points per kill and also the games will go very fast now the score limit on team deathmatch has been put back to 75 which i think is much better than 100 because if it's 100 you don't really get that much xp and you're also grinding out for around 10 minutes now another method i have for you guys is definitely go ahead and prestige your weapons as soon as you can because prestige your weapons allows you to get the challenges to unlock all of your attachments so i know it's difficult to play the game without attachments sometimes but trust me guys if you want to rank up fast definitely go ahead prestige your weapons as soon as possible if you guys don't know how to go ahead and do that, you can do it in the headquarters mode. You can go over to the gunsmith and prestige your weapon there. Do it all the way to the max rank and once you're on max rank on that weapon, I'll definitely consider switching over to a different weapon and just giving all of the weapons a try. Now, I know some weapons are not as good as others, so you will most likely want to stick with that one weapon. But if you do want to rank up fast, definitely give other weapons a try because I've personally done that and found out some of the best weapons in the game already. Now those two methods I already told you, which is prestige your divisions as soon as possible, and not only that, but prestige your weapons. Now there's another one that comes into play in the headquarters mode, and that is from your quartermaster and the other guy. There's two guys within the headquarters mode where you can actually accept challenges and contracts for your character. I know some of them do cost, but once you actually go ahead and purchase them, you can get ones which allow you to get 3000 XP just for simply getting three headshots in a game and even getting rare supply drops. Now that's another method method of getting supply drops but not only that you guys want to get a weapon out of the supply drops that gives you 10% extra XP now now I have been lucky enough to actually get some of these weapons out of supply drops that do allow me to get the extra XP but if not don't worry just keep on trying to get yourself some supply drops and you'll eventually get these weapons now we already know from previous Call of Duty titles another method of ranking up very fast in this game is just run UAV just run UAV on its own you can constantly call them in and you will get assists from calling them in now this is great because your team will also be able to help you and get the game finished faster if you do manage to get multiple uavs within the game we all know once you have a uav it really does help you go ahead finish the game and locate your enemies much faster now not only that if the enemy team is calling in a load of kill streaks for some reason go ahead pull out a rocket launcher and take down all of them streaks you guys can actually equip a rocket launcher through one of the basic trainings and once you go ahead and do that you get a ton of xp for taking down aircrafts because not many people go ahead and do that in this game now not only that once you take down a certain amount of aircrafts you will actually get a challenge as well which will give you a ton of xp to go ahead and allow you guys to rank up even more not only that but going for gold guns will actually help you rank up faster as well we all know the gold gun challenges are really good at the moment they give you a ton of xp and the best weapons to go ahead and get gold guns on is definitely the snipers or the shotguns as they do not require headshots now I know people like to use SMGs and assault rifles, but if you guys are trying to get that last bit of XP to go ahead and prestige, definitely give it a try. Try and use a sniper rifle or a shotgun. All you do is need to get those one-shot kills and you guys can actually unlock yourself gold camo. 
Now, for some reason, if you don't enjoy Team Deathmatch and you're getting a bit bored of it, definitely hop in War because War is a great game mode if you have a good team. Now, this only works if you have a good team because you guys are going to need to win the game and you are going to need to get roughly 80 kills in a game. From doing that, you will get around 40,000 XP, but the games do last around 20 minutes. Now, in my experience in Team Deathmatch, I could pull around 18,000 XP in a simple six minute game with around 35 kills. So, Team Deathmatch is proven to be the best right now until they do probably fix domination into 100 points per kill. That's all I've got for you guys in this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully this helps you out to rank up. And of course, let me know down in the comment section below what rank are you right now in Call of Duty World War 2. Like I said, I'm currently first prestige level 42. And I do have a video planned on showcasing my prestige 2 stats later on on the channel. So make sure you stick around for that. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys have a great day and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.